Hey everyone, a match cut can create a nice movie-like transition from one shot to another, like this one, where the shot of the speaker cuts to the shot of the plate. There's also a little secret I'll show you to make it look even more graceful. To create a match cut in DaVinci Resolve, add your two clips to the timeline that you want to match cut together. If the clips have movement in them, you're going to need to find the spot in each clip where things will line up or match up. Start with the first clip and find the point where you want it to end and then trim the end to that point. Move the second clip up a track and over the top of the first clip. Click to select the second clip and open the inspector. Scroll down to the composite section and reduce the opacity to about 50%. Make sure the playhead is at the end of the first clip so that you can see its last frame. If snapping makes this hard just let it snap to the end of the first clip and hit the left arrow on the keyboard to move back one frame. Now you can drag the second clip that's on top here left and right to find where the cut should go. To fine tune the match you can use the inspector to zoom in a bit and change the position of the clips to get a better match. In this case we're going to zoom in on the bottom speaker layer and also adjust the position a bit. Now we can trim the start of the second clip, drag it down next to the first clip, change its opacity back to 100 and this is what we get. You can spend a bit more time than I did to get it perfect and even speed up or slow down the clips to get any motion lining up. To add that secret source that I mentioned, open the effects, choose video transitions, drag the cross dissolve onto the point where the two clips meet. If you need to, zoom in by hitting Ctrl and plus on the keyboard, adjust the length of the cross dissolve to get the look you want, and this is the result. We can improve things a bit. What I'm going to do is select the second clip and hit Ctrl R to open the retime controls. What I want is the second clip movement of the plate to be a bit faster, so I'm going to grab the top right and drag it left to increase playback speed of this second clip. Okay, that looks better. Let's check it full screen. And that looks much better now. The match cut is just one of five cuts you can use forever that you'll learn about if you watch this video next. I'm Jason Roberts and hopefully I'll see you again.